Hi everyone, um, so I'm back with part two of week 22 and for this week I'm using the Design D um, pocket page which is the four portrait 6x4s and then the four 3x4s that are landscape down the middle. Um, so I actually have photos for all four portrait photos which is good because uh, sometimes I do struggle. I find that there's not that many cut parts that are portrait, a lot of them are landscape. So I'm glad to have uh, photos for all of them. So this was me pretty much down south because I went down south on the Thursday. I was there the Friday and the Saturday. So I got up to quite a few things and I took quite a few photos. So that was good. So the Friday, um, obviously I got there quite late down on the Thursday. I got there about eight o'clock. So I had a bath and went to bed. And then on the Friday, I got up and I met one of my school friends that I've kept in touch with. She's coming to our wedding. I've been to her wedding. Uh, we're quite close. So um you know, we try and keep in touch with her as much as we can. She's now got two kids, um, so I try and see her as much as I can. And she's just had her second, which is baby Cece, and she's so cute. Um, so I met her down um, in the town, and we walked up, we got a coffee, and we went to the park and let her toddler play around. We went for a walk and things, and it was just really nice. We caught up. Um, she was telling me about how things are with her, and I was sort of keeping her updated with how we are about the wedding plans and stuff so that was really nice um so the first sort of top section is going to be all about um me and baby Cece basically because she's so cute I love meeting my friends babies and because I don't have my own kids I'm fully using you know other people's kids as my little like do I want kids do I not want kids you know they are very very cute but I can hand them back so it's a completely different situation to having my own kids um but the first picture is just a picture of baby Cece in her pram. Um, she looks like a little doll and she had the cutest little knitted uh, jumper on with like a little pixie hood. And it was just so cute. Um, so I'm just going to put a little flag at the top and then some washi tape at the bottom with some flowers and a little love uh, word sticker. Well, cut apart. The section in the middle, I'm actually going to use a cut apart that says the best days are happening right now, which I thought was quite cute. And it's ever it's not a three by four. It's probably half the size. Um, so I just stick it in the middle of um, some pattern paper. And that is everything for that one. As I said, it's quite difficult. I find these ones quite difficult because there's not that many landscape three by fours and there's not that many portrait three, uh, six by fours so you do have to be a bit more creative uh, but it does force you to use things that a bit harder to use so that's why I do push myself to use these ones rather than be it play, like playing it safe and using the easier ones um, I don't want these pocket pages to go to waste so I want to try and use up as much as I can the photo that's going to go above that is a picture of me looking down at baby Cece. Um, she just started crying, bless her, and I was trying to cheer her up. Um, but Jess was really good. She was taking pictures, and I love having these pictures um, to look back on, especially when, obviously, kids grow up so quickly. So it'll be just nice to see her when she's a bit older and remembering what she was like when she was that age. So, yeah, I'm just going to put some little flower stickers again and um, a word sticker that says home. Um because it's just nice to see your school friends and stuff. We've been friends since, yeah, since we were teenagers. So it's really cute to see um, how everyone's just evolving. Obviously, we're nearly off in our 30s now. So it's, um, yeah, it's quite bizarre. So the last photo that's going to go beside that is, again, a picture of me and Cece. And I absolutely adore this photo. I think it's the cutest thing ever. Her little face, um, just, she looks so displeased with me. Like, she just, like, put me down, human. I do not want to be here but she just looks so cute um yeah <laughs> it makes me laugh every time I see it um and I'm just going to use a little journaling uh, tab thing um cut apart at the bottom so obviously I can write some bits about it and then also put a word cut apart at the top that says very best because it really does make me laugh um that photo so yeah so that's what I did on Friday um and we only sorry we were done by sort of like half past 12 so then later on I actually went down into the town with my sister um I had to get some bits for Father's Day and stuff because I wasn't here for, I'm not here for Father's Day which is the 18th of June I'm away so I won't be able to speak to my dad um the way that I would normally or anything so I wanted to make sure he had his present and his card um before I went away so I went down into the town with my sister and got a card and things I also got some postcards for my post crossing because it's very very difficult to find postcards here where I'm from um so with my hometown being a bit more touristy I was able to find some postcards and stuff so I can keep my stash up of that 
And then um, on the way back, my sister said, oh, do you want to go into this museum? And I'd never, ever been in this museum before. Um, obviously, I lived in my hometown for 18 years before I moved out and I'd never been to the museum about it. Um, so we went in and it was free. And I bought a fridge magnet uh, because I thought, why not? I've got fridge magnets of all around the world. Why not have one of my hometown? Um, but we just had a look around and just sort of, it basically explained it from the start which I thought was quite cool um so yeah we just went in had a look around I um put some washi tape at the bottom of that photo and uh put a little home sweet home round sticker because it is quite good it's my hometown so uh, and this was just one of the exhibits in the little museum um so that was quite cute and I also put the little sticker that says welcome then next to that um I put a photo of these flowers. These flowers are growing in my mum and dad's garden and they were so pretty. I don't know what they are, but they were just these big, huge purple flowers. Um, so they were really, really pretty. My mum and dad's garden is lovely this time of year because they're all out in bloom and they have just so many different plants and it's so pretty. Um, so I try and get some pictures of their flowers whenever I go down um, in the summer. So I'm gonna use the sticker that says home is where your heart is and also a word sticker that says our house. Then the cut apart, there was actually a cut apart, a proper three by four one that I could use. And it just says live simply because my parents do, to be honest. And we are quite a simple family. Um, we just like to sit out in the garden and um, have a barbecue. And then, the you know, you'll see on the photo that's going to go on the right hand side. We enjoy going to boot sales and charity shops and stuff like that. So um, we really enjoy, you know, just little simple things in life. We don't really do very very expensive things um I'm quite a budget person I know that I travel a lot but I do it on a budget um and I always try and get the best deal and I search around and you know I go at the times of year that you know the cheaper times of year and stuff like that I, I don't splurge as such I do save my money in order to you know do as much as I can on as little money as possible um so yeah so we went to the boot sale on the Saturday so that is what this picture is. It's just of the boot sale in the field. Um, so I'm going to use this large sticker that says our happy place, um, a word sticker that says family, and then also another cut apart where I can put some journaling at the top as well, um, just to explain that we went to this boot sale. It wasn't too big, actually, too fair. Um, it was only a couple, like a few lines of stools, um, but I actually managed to get two dresses that were brand new off the tag with the tag still on, and they were £2 each. So I was really happy with that. Um, so yeah, we really enjoy boot sales. My mum got a dress and my sister got a coat. So um, yeah, I just, we don't have them much up here. So it's more of a southern thing for me. <laughs> but I hope you've enjoyed this one and I'll be back hopefully soon after my holiday. Thank you very much. Bye.